Okay, so Lindsay from Freedom Media WA. So we're at the Joondalup um, Lakeside Shopping Centre and we've had reports that students are coming in um, to be vaccinated. Yep. Joondalup Security. Yeah. Sorry, so you're wanting to call security? So, yep. Yeah. Okay. Yep, yeah, so would you like to talk about your concern? Could you call? Would you like to talk about your concern? Sorry? Would you like to talk about, yeah? Private property? You need to go to centre management. Okay, thank you. Yep, yeah, no problems at all. Okay, yeah, no, I'm right. Thank you very much. So what's happening is um, we have students that are coming in. Um, they're being bussed in by their schools. We're here to cover the other side. We have some concerned parents here that are um, talking about saying no. You don't have permission to do this. Okay, so again the question is, if the state government has said that children from the age of 14 can give consent, then the question is, can they actually withdraw the consent? So uh, similarly stories to what we saw at the convention centre, um, they're all laughing, they don't really understand what's going on, and, uh, but there is some very serious grave concerns here about what's going on. And you can see from the immediate reaction that we've had, that they simply do not, uh, they do not want uh, anything here um, to be um, to be filmed. So, um, so we're at the Joondalup Lakeside Shopping Centre, and uh, we're talking about schools that are coming in. Um, we've had reports yesterday that they went to Several Grove School. They were busing children in for the uh, for the injection, and there was no parental uh, permission or consent. So are you a teacher there for the students? Are you a teacher for the students? You are a teacher? Yep, yeah. okay. Would you like to just explain in terms of this school excursion? Thank you. Yeah, okay. So you, um, would you understand duty of, um, duty of care for the students? Do you feel confident that these students understand the consent and what they've actually signed for? Yes. Yep. Yeah. And uh, what information as a teacher have you actually given to these students? No comment. No comment? Is that the information you've given to the students? No comment? No comment. Okay. So uh, yet yeah, the children are aware that they can give consent but they can also withdraw the consent. Do you think that's... No comment. No comment? Okay. So that, uh, so here we have a teacher with Judy of Care talking about... Um, so yeah, Colin. Yeah, Colin Payne. Thank you very much, Colin. You're from the Woodvale Secondary College. And um, so in terms of talking about duty of care for the uh, students I should say, um, it's a whole lot of no comment. Students simply don't know what's going on. Yep, sorry, what's your, yeah, do you have your licence crowd yeah, control the details there? Can you just produce that for me, thanks? This is not crowd control, this yep. is security. Yep. You've got your okay, so, yep, can you, can you produce Move your out. identification? Move I've just you witnessed you. Right Move now. Yep. You are not promises, man. You are not, you are not promises, man. You need to leave right now. Okay. Do you have your licence security out. crowd control you details here? Are you a licensed crowd controller? Of course. This is not a crowd controller. Okay. This is not security. Crowd control. Are you a licensed crowd controller? This is not a crowd controller. This is security. Okay. Are you a registered security agent? Security. Are you a registered security agent? Probably you're not a media person. Like seems like us with corrections, oi. You need to leave right now, man. So, are you a registered Freedom Media Western Australia? Yep. So that's in your opinion. You are now promises, man. You are to Okay, so we're at the uh, Lakeside Joondalup Shopping Centre, and uh, that's fine. Yep, call the police. Do what you need to do.
Okay, so again we have uh, Woodvale Secondary College have bussed their students into um, to, uh, the Lakeside Junlap Injection Clinic. The question is around consent. So 14 year old students uh, have been told by the state government that they can give consent and what we've seen, we've seen an unidentified person here that has been extremely aggressive. Just be calm, everybody. Uh, he, he, was, he was ripping signs down um, from the people, and, uh, you know, and I guess they're asking him the question, is he a licensed crowd controller? Is he a registered security agent? And the answer is no. Unfortunately, you're going about this the wrong way. If you want to, if you want to give people information about it, you need to ask centre management first, okay? Because you haven't gone through the correct channels. We're okay. just asking you to leave. You haven't gotten permission to distribute this in the centre. So all of you will just need to leave for now. If you yep. want, you can call them up. So did the centre management give that gentleman there the permission to rip signs out of these people's hands and manhandle them? I haven't seen what they've done. I can't Okay, well, I'm telling you that that's what I've just wit so written. You're just trespassing at the moment, so I'm going to have to ask you to leave. You okay. haven't gotten Thank you. I've heard what you've said. So I just need you to leave for yep. now. Okay. You can call up centre management, get the correct... Uh, get the correct channels going, go through the correct venue of information. You can get a pop-up in here if you'd like to, but at the moment you can't actually be here, so yeah, I'll ask okay. you to leave. Today. Yeah, no problems at all. So I guess I just want to reiterate the question. Does the Centre Security Management issue the instruction to manhandle people? Is that, a, is that an instruction from Centre Management? You need to leave for now. Because if you stay here, this is private property, we have asked you to leave. If you don't leave, it'll be trespass, the police have been called. So I'll just ask you to leave. Hey, man, here, Mr. And you're standing around, this is a propaganda. And the children are Here that has been extremely aggressive. Uh, he, he, was, he was ripping signs down um, from the people. And uh, you know, and I guess they're asking him the question: Is he a licensed crowd controller? Is he a registered security agent? And the answer is no. Unfortunately, you're going about this the wrong way. If you want to, if you want to give people information about it, you need to ask centre management first. Okay because you haven't gone through the correct channels. We're okay. just asking you to leave. You haven't gotten permission to distribute this in the centre. So all of you will just need to leave for now. If you yep. want, you can call them up. So did the centre management give that gentleman there the permission to rip signs out of these people's hands and manhandle them? I haven't seen what they've done. I can't okay, well, I'm telling you that that's what I've just wit so written. You're just trespassing at the moment, so I'm going to have to ask you to leave. You okay. haven't gotten Thank you. I've heard what you've said. So I just need you to leave for yep. now. Okay. You can call up centre management, get the correct... Uh, get the correct channels going, go through the correct venue of information. You can get a pop-up in here if you'd like to, but at the moment you can't actually be here, so yeah, I'll ask okay. you to leave. Today. Yeah, no problems at all. So I guess I just want to reiterate the question. Does the Centre Security Management issue the instruction to manhandle people? Is that, a, is that an instruction from Centre Management? You need to leave for now. Because if you stay here, this is private property, we have asked you to leave. If you don't leave, it'll be trespass, the police have been called. So I'll just ask you to leave. Hey, man, here, Mr. And you're standing around, this is a propaganda. And the children are being, okay? Children are being, and you know about it. Loving this, aren't you? Let him go. Thanks, guys. Let him go. He's out of the shop. He is out of the shop. Okay. Why do you touch people like that? Because, sorry, are you are you a licensed security agent? Are you a licensed security agent? Yep. Yep. Okay. Yep. I'd just like to see your identification there. 
give us your names no, you if you think name. you have authority. Yes, you do. You don't have the correct media. You can't come in at Don't you. touch me. You keep your hands in. away from me. No, man. You can't come in. We're putting another bus load of kids. We have evidence that children are being injured. We have evidence. Oh, so children are being injured. So you can't come in. Touch me. You can't come in. Take your hand off me. Take your hand off me. You can't. Take your hand off me. You can't come in. You can't come in. Take your hand off me. You, hand off me. you damage this camera gear. But you Take your hand off me. I need to pick up my microphone. You need to leave right now. Who are you? That's our equipment. I'm picking up my microphone. You need to leave right now. Don't touch him. Do not touch him. I'm going for my microphone. So, excuse me. Take you are assaulting me. You are assaulting me. You've been recording too, man. There's a choice. People are allowed to make a free choice. So just to let you know here, you have caused damage to my equipment. Okay. Man, you so caused damage to me. You have caused damage to my equipment. Okay. And you continue to manhandle me. Right now. Come on. Yep. So you have I'm pointing out I'm pointing out the damage that you've caused to my equipment. Okay? That is all my concern is. Yes we can. And this and we're doing it right. Media WA, where journalism should never be a government narrative. Like, share and subscribe to my channel to see real people telling real stories.